Hello everyone, this is System Collapse, and I'm back yet again playing, well, this time, FTB Beyond. And, uh, yeah, brand new pack. Still has that brand new pack smell, and, uh, I'm gonna play through this one. I'm gonna play through this one. I literally just loaded up this map, and, uh, I think I'm creating a new one. <laughs> Let's take a look. <laughs> I spawned in the center of an ocean. <laughs> what's the luck? What's what's the chances? Uh, and I'm not gonna play, you know... Uh, a water block <laughs> map so I will probably be back in a second when I get a hopefully another one not in the ocean I'll be back in a sec okay and I'm back and it looks like I got a much better spawn much better spawn <laughs> we can actually work with this one I got water around I got flat grounds I got some trees a little sparse on the trees but uh, we, we, we can do the sapling thing it's not a big deal um, yeah, yeah, new pack, new pack, tons of new mods that I've never touched, uh, embers, industrial craft, uh, thermal expansion, is it thermal expansion or dynamics, I can never remember, Therm thermal expansion, there you go, 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 go with what you think first, uh, so yeah, I'm very excited. I'm excited to play this mod pack. I'm now excited to play this one. It's going to be really cool. Really cool. You get to play, you know, all the newest 110 mods. And it's all the big ones. Like, there's some I've never touched. Industrial craft, never touched it. Have no clue. No clue what I'm getting into. Um, it has both refined storage and AE2, which is kind of cool. So it kind of gives you a choice. I'm actually going to do both, but we'll get into that later. Um... Well, we'll get into it now. I'm actually going to end up doing uh, two bases. I've already come to the conclusion I'm going to do two bases because there is a good amount of magic mods in this pack. So you got your Batania, you got your Blood Magic, you've got Embers, which isn't technically magic, but it's kind of like magical tech, I guess you could say. Kind of this dwarven magical tech thing stuff. Yeah, that, that's what I'm going with. And it's pretty cool. I mean, and uh, I've actually, it's its really cool, and I've been wanting to play that one. You guys are really making a bad life choice because I need uh, wool for a bit, and I always love leather. So let's get you first. <laughs> and this isn't a hard pack. There's, this is not going to be a hard pack. The hard version will come out later, the expert mode. Uh, for right now, this is kind of just a, a showcase of mods. Um, Kinda, you know, show what's out there for 110, and uh, I'm gonna enjoy it. I'm gonna enjoy it. It's gonna be more of a relaxed playthrough, and it's gonna allow me to do, you know, the techie stuff, but at the same time creative. So you can make things look better. You can focus more on singular mods because you're not really aiming for an end game goal. Um, but you name it, pretty much every big mod that's out there right now, except for maybe a space one. There's no Galactic Craft or Rocketry. Um, advanced rocketry so are, are in this pack they're just there I see clay over there and that's something I am gonna need cuz kinda looking around trying to figure out a good spot to set up I've been looking at early early power sources and kinda deciding what I wanna do and my last couple playthroughs I've been skipping early power cuz early power is something I always dread because it's not that there's anything wrong with it it's just me being impatient uh, I'd rather grind out hard to get 500 RF than spend my time, you know, working for 40 RF at a time. So that is the thing, but we are going to do it in this pack. We're going to do an early game power source because it's something I haven't done in a while and, uh, i got to stop relying on environmental tech because I've already came to the conclusion that I'm, that mod is too good. You know a mod is too good when you go keep going back to it over and over and over. So stuff like Ender IO, it's too good. It's too good. It just it out it surpasses almost everything else like it. Um, then there's other ones like that, of course. But uh, certain mod mods are just so good. Thermal expansion, if it's like it was a one seven at all, again, it's just too good. The machines are too good and. People are just going to end up rely on them. It was nice not having thermal expansion for a while because it actually caused people to do things in new ways. And uh, a lot of other mods kind of got looked at. You know what I mean? I, I don't think like actually add-ons would have really got looked at if there wasn't a hole that needed to be filled. 
Uh, it, it would have been around and it would have been there, but it gave us stuff that we needed. It filled holes and now it's going to be, you know, it'll be around forever and it'll always be doing its thing. So we're already getting clay, so we're already looking at a possible smeltery. I see um, gravel exposed over here. Uh, good amount of trees. I might set up right here because then I have access to sand. Uh, access to more clay. I've got water. The only thing I am missing is lava, but uh, I could always find that underground. I don't see above world source right now. Uh, my goal for today isn't much. It is pretty much get myself a safe area, get some torches going, possibly a smeltery. And it's looking like a smeltery almost definitely now because I have everything I need. I have sand, I have gravel, and I have clay. Uh, and what was the other thing? There was something else I wanted to do today. A couple other little items. Uh, need a couple more sheep for those. Oh, don't don't break my stuff. I need that. Did I bring my crafting table? I left it behind. Oh, well. Uh, Tinker's tools, of course. Uh, one of the things I want to rush, actually, is getting to the mining dimension. So I would like to do that today. So let's see here. Uh, what is it? Frame? It's like a Roma. Yeah, Roma 1997's Dimension World. I want to get straight to here as fast as possible. And it's really cheap. You just need four, eight, eight stone. You need one iron. One iron is the most expensive thing. And uh, we're going to get those. I'll find iron, no problem. Uh, and we're going to go there. That's going to be where I do the bulk of my mining. Uh, because it's just easier there. It's a flat world. Uh, like things like iron are right on the surface. I need some stone. But, uh, so yeah, it's just super, super useful. And I'm going to be spending a lot of time there. A lot of time there. And when I do set up a quarry and stuff, that's going to be where it goes. That kind of stuff. Uh, what was I doing? I, I got all talky. Talky make it ranty. <laughs> I guess I just need a couple stones, so. Uh, so what I might do here, though, is take a little, you know, break from you guys. Uh, farm up some resources. Get a couple stacks of stone, a couple stacks of wood. And, uh, yeah, we'll start uh, getting to stuff. Because I'm going to be doing this for a little while. And I don't think it's very entertaining. I mean, it's just a little bit of commentary over doing, ooh, sugar cane. Early sugar cane's always a good thing, but uh, <laughs> isn't very entertaining. You're getting the idea, and uh, I want to get to you know the point where we can get at least a little bit of progression. Okay, and I'm back, and I think I found a place where I'm just gonna kind of set up base here. I found a ravine, and I figure ravine equals access, easy access to uh, uh, getting to lower ores. Oh, that's funny. I think the second I touch these, they're all gonna fall. Look at that. <laughs> Hilarious. Um, yeah, so this is going to be where I set up base. Just uh, initially. Uh, tell me I don't fall. I just want to get those dropped now as opposed to have them drop on me later. But I see copper. I see bauxite. I see coal. I don't see iron. Oh, there's aluminum. Yeah. So, I mean, easy access to resources. Got a giant desert here. So, get tons of glass. Uh, I have a little... Things set up above ground lava right over there. So I'm not going to stay here by any means, but it is a good place just to set up and kind of get going. I built myself some Tinker's tools, just uh, stone ones, just uh, real, real basic stuff. Nothing fancy there. Uh, what is that? Tool station. We need, I guess, a crafting table. Uh, be nice to have a chest. That down here, I guess. Oop, that is totally not where I want it. Bam. The only thing I have a little lack of, well, no, I got trees right there. Okay, well, I guess this will do. Do for our start area. We can make grout, so let's look at that. Grout. I did get sand and this stuff. Boom. Get some of that. Some dish. I just got wood. Yeah, there you go. No, not there. This. I'm just going to let this smelt. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep harvesting. I'm going to smelt down all this stuff. This is going to take some while. I need to cut down quite a few stacks of trees. I probably need about four stacks of trees to get going. Uh, logs. And uh, 
I might try to jerry rig some kind of pathway down here. I don't see a lot of mobs spawning down here. There's probably some down that way. Doesn't look too bad though. And I have another possible lava source there, which is good. But uh, I'm going to do that. I'm going to hammer that out and uh, I'll be back again. Okay, and I'm back, and I got myself a little bit of iron, so we, we, we can do some stuff. We can do some stuff. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that, actually. Let's uh grab this, and I want to do this to do single items, so we're going to use tiny coal. Good old tiny coal. I didn't do it here, either. Uh, I got myself a decent amount of coal down in the, in the ravine. That's still going. Where's that? There's grub. No, that's MDC8. Trashy. Vanilla. Vanilla friggin'. Vanilla. Vanilla things? Vanilla stuff. <laughs> Trashy vanilla ores that I don't need. So I don't want to worry about those right now. I do want to get the iron in there. Um, yeah. So first thing I need is iron tools because these, these, this pick, <laughs> it's not doing much for me. Uh, I can't get a, half the stuff. I can't get the bauxite. I can't get the aluminum. Uh, I think they were like diamond level, so I'm gonna even have to wait on those. Um, but with one piece of iron, one piece of iron, we can get into the mining dimension, I'm pretty sure. So let's see here. We need, it's at the, the frames. Why am I doing that? We need the frames, so we're gonna do this, and we're gonna need one of these multi tools, and we need stone bricks. So I know I got cobble on me. I don't know if I have enough, but. Oh, it's got to be stone. Well, I'm going to have to smelt some snow stone, too. What we can do, though, is start working on the smeltery. Hands down. That is something we can do. We've got a fair amount. I don't know if we have enough, though. So let's take a look here. We're going to need to not do that. We're going to need two smeltery drains. So let's do those real quick. Two smeltery drains. So two smeltery drains. Good. We're going to need two faucets. Grab those. And I think I'm going to be short, but it's not that big a deal. I know I got a tiny bit more grout. Let's get that cooking. Uh, we're also going to need one piece of sand cooked. For the tank, uh, the controller is going to be debt. Going to need the basin. Yep, let's throw that real quick. Now I'm going to have to upgrade my chest really soon because this is driving me nuts. <laughs> I found some service quartz down there. There was a good amount of resources, just most of them I don't have the tools to grab yet. So let's throw that in there. Uh, I need this to get going though. I need a smeltery just so we can get into... I'm going to have anywhere near enough grout, and I? Well, that's a problem. Oh, we got this. Let's do our mining dimension. <laughs> Let's just skip that and we'll get back to the other one. So we need a stone pickaxe and we need a flinted steel. So we need one flint, which I have. I have two. And you can make flint actually if you don't want to sit there and punch gravel. There's actually a recipe for it. Uh, where is it? Here, there you go. It's just uh, three gravel. Shapeless, do it any way you like. Do that, do this, do that. We got a stick, we got that, we got that. We just need some of that stone. There we go. Oh, I just need the flint and steel. Okay, so this, this, that, this, and that. There we go. We got our mining tool. And this is kind of a tool. It's got uh, durability, so it uh, breaks. It like wears down, but that's not a big deal. Eight, how many are we gonna need? Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 will do it, but we'll do a couple more. That works. 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 if we do it that way. Okay, we'll do it that way. But uh, we'll have access now to a new dimension already. I mean, it's our first day. And uh, yeah, we are already going to have access to a new fancy mining dimension to uh, get our mining. Get our mining done. Boop. And boop. And. Another placement block, and another placement block, boop, boop, and boop, this, do that, 
and do that and we're done and we can take this thing and just go boop there you go kind of mining dimension oh that's gonna drive me <laughs> gotta get rid of that where is it where is it and is that fully repaired yes it is that's doing its stone thing that's doing the seared brick thing uh, I am gonna have to go grab some more I got gravel and clay right there so it's gonna be easy to get but let's go check out the mining dimension really quick uh, when you go in the portal it won't do anything you actually gotta hit the shift key and sneak uh, yeah something to remember just so you don't walk in the portal and go this thing isn't working and we got ourselves a mining dimension mining dimension we've got granite garter knight hmm. i don't even know what that is garner oh it's got a broken texture what's this tech reborn what is tech reborn <laughs> every time i think i know a mod oh it's all got all kinds of weird stuff well another one they could do a thermal generator that sounds cool Digital chest. Oh, more fun stuff to play with. Excellent. More toys. So we'll get into that mod at some point. But uh, we got this portal here now, and uh, there's all kinds of ores everywhere. So just uh, another another place to come and mine. It's entirely, you know, there's a little bit of dirt, and you'll run across some trees across the surface. But uh, you can find iron, find other stuff right on right on the surface. So that makes that easy. Uh, because I actually want to get a good amount of iron. One of the first things I want is actually the tool forge. So we can get straight into good tinker's tools. I want to have a hammer. I want to have an uh, excavator. All that jazz. Just things to make mining really quick. I should have probably marked that. But I'm not going to worry about it. There's a tree there way off in the distance. And uh, yeah, if we dig down, we'll get the regular ores. But uh, for right now, the one I mostly need is just iron and I can kind of just pillage the surface <laughs> get a whole bunch of it so I'm gonna get a whole bunch of this and uh, we'll probably probably get on to other things we're gonna get that tool forge we're gonna get our tools and uh, ooh, copper and uh, you know get on with the progression get on with the progression okay I'm back and I got some more. I got some more stuff. I got stuff things. I got a clogged inventory. <laughs> Smelting down yet more of the seared brick. I got some food. Give me my food. Uh, yeah. First thing I'm going to deal with. I just cut down a eucalyptus tree. They're a giant pain. <laughs> They're so tall. You, I think, no, those are like cherry something. Eucalyptus though, branches all over the place. It was an annoying tree to cut down. Just going to throw that out there. But uh, something I want to make here. My inventory is going to drive me nuts. So we're going to make one of these. We're going to make... Uh, we're going to need some sticks. Uh, some crates. We're going to make some crates. I think they're going to make our lives a lot easier. Oop, I'm going to just throw that for a second. Got to come here. Do this. Got to make the casing. So it's just... It's all wood. Might as well make a couple. Yeah, let's make four. Grab that. Boom. This will give us one right away and then we'll make more uh, <laughs> I'm so so just clogged right now so boop these have a giant inventory so you you for very little resources you get a ton of storage so these are something that everyone is gonna want everyone just 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 make one man and I guess we need a tank so let's make this your tank is it this or is it this I think it's this actually I have a piece of glass on me sweet there we go and we have a controller. That should be all that stuff. The rest of it should be just bricks. Uh, so there's 12. We don't need a ton. Like I said, we're going to do a small one. And I need to keep three aside. So let's do that. I'm just going to throw it over here by the portal. doesn't really matter where it goes. Um, and we're going to do the bare minimum. <laughs> because... I don't want to have to go dig more gravel. I'll get more of that, like I said. Mining dimension. Mining dimension is going to be my friend. There we go. One there. Uh, we'll need two smeltery drains. So that's fine. That's fine. I can put the tank right here, I believe. There we go. It's going to be pretty ghetto. I'm, I'm, I'm not lying. I wasn't joking. Boop. 
but it will get the job done so and that's all we care about right now the only problem is right now <laughs> we don't have any gold so I am gonna have to deal with that go and there we go and it's not working oh because we need one more okay this do that And moment of truth. There we go. Lights on. That's on. Uh, and we just need my iron, which I probably threw in here. I already made a bucket. Go. And I can take the rest of that iron right away and throw that in there. It's not going to have a lot of internal capacity, but uh, it will get it done. Uh, I can only hold 12 blocks right now. But uh, we're going to grab some lava real quick. And I don't have a tank. Actually, that would be just smart to do. Why don't I just bring the tank with me and fill it up? Yep. Got to run. Time is of the essence. <laughs> be up and running with the smeltery. It is awesome. It gives us ore doubling, and we can't put it in the blocks and break it down the agates, so it's not a big deal. Uh, and we got lava. It did break my iron. Oh, no, it kicks it out now. Okay, it didn't used to do that. Okay. Cool. It's doing its smeltery thing, and uh, yeah, we have smeltery. We have a smeltery. Uh, we also want the tool forge. So let's get on that. Boom. Uh, I didn't keep three, like I said. Oh, yes, I did. It, but you just need the iron blocks, which I already made, which I should have waited because I could have doubled all this. I don't even know what I'm thinking. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, what is it? I need a tool station. Tool station. This one. Don't need that one anymore. So let's do that and this. And we now have a tool forge. So. We can make the better tools. I can already get it into hammers. I can get into uh, hammers, excavators, lumber axe is going to be giant. Uh, all the good stuff. All the good stuff now. And uh, we're looking pretty good. We're looking pretty good for the first day. Oh, I had another stack of seared bricks. <laughs> I can't believe myself sometimes. And I don't know if that's enough to go around. Oh, it is. I thought I was a little short. There we go. There we go. We got two blocks there. Boop. Oh, boop. And uh, yeah, so we've got we've got a, got our ores being processed. Simple as that. We can actually fit some stuff in there now, and we're looking good. We're looking good. I am gonna make more of these storage crates for sure because they are such. They're too cheap, honestly. They're too cheap. Uh, the recipes, I don't know why they made them so cheap, whoever. I have more. I'm such a derp. Ah, uh, I was wondering why I was so short on seared bricks. When I did it the first time, I could have swore I had enough. And I was just like, okay, something used a lot more than I thought it was going to. And uh, I just didn't check my inventories properly. And I'll get, you know, oh, you're such a derp in the comments, but uh, it is what it is. I probably could have already had this done. Uh, yeah, there we go. We've got, uh, we got ore doubling. We have ore doubling. Our ore is being doubled, uh, which is amazing for this early. And uh, we've got all the stuff that we need to get going in this world. Um, I'm gonna build a bunch more of these. I'm gonna do a bunch more mining. I'm gonna head to the uh, to the uh, mining dimension, and I'm actually gonna look for gold. Cause right now I need to make tools, but I can't make gold. And I don't know what tool I need to make uh, to get gold. Don't know if it tells you here. It doesn't. Uh, I'm guessing it's going to be iron. So I might have to make a vanilla iron pick just to make it easy. Uh, but once I have gold. Basically, only need two, two, two gold. Yeah, two gold, and then uh, I can start making the cast for the for the for the weapons and uh, get going that way. But uh, 
I thought I just saw more seared bricks. I was going to rage at myself. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I think I'm going to end this here. I'm going to end this here. Uh, I think we made a decent amount of progress. Decent amount. And uh, we'll get up to a lot more as we go. Of course, we're going to start slow. Tomorrow, we're going to have to get to that. We're going to have to get to that slime island. I want slime. Uh, slime boots and slime sling. Just uh, for easy travel and safety from falling from drops. Because I don't know what the long falls are now. Long fall? Fall? Long fall boots? City and iron diamond. See, that's way too expensive to bother. I could just do slime. So why bother with the long falls? Okay, so I think I think I think I'm gonna end this here. I'm gonna end it here. Um, we've got a good amount of progress. I'm happy with today. It was a good first episode. I'm enjoying this back. I can't wait to get through more and see a lot more of it. Um, in between videos, could be mostly mining, mostly mining and punching grass in the hopes of getting. I'm not sure if you get or not. I would like to get some uh, ooh, roots. Uh, what are they called? Ender lilies, just to get some easy source of ender pearls. That just make my life a lot easier. But uh, yeah, I'm going to end this here. And as always, if you like this video, please hit that like button. If you really liked it, hit that subscribe button. It's much appreciated. And uh, yeah, there's going to be many more of these videos. Many more. It's going to be at least as long as Sky Factory 3, if not longer, because there are so many ridiculously large mods in this pack where I could just do silly things that are unnecessary. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm going to take off. I want you guys all to have a good one. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Later.